On January 2nd, 1922, in Dallas during the Dixie Classic, the forerunner of the Cotton Bowl, an Aggie E. King Gill, was called from the stands to suit up as a substitute, hence the phrase 12th man. The football players needed an extra person to be there on the field with them just in case they needed a substitute, and they just randomly asked E. King Gill if he could be that person, you know, just in case they needed a substitute, and he just said yes and was up to the task. That readiness is something that still goes on today. For our students here at Texas A&M, they're always here to support the athletes, and it's a progressive generational thing. As, as each generation goes on, it continues to be passed down and continues to be advocated to the next generation. So I think it's something that really makes Texas A&M special. You show the 12th men by always being there for each other, being there for your fellow Ags in every aspect, not just football, not just like helping out each other. All those stuff count as being a 12th man, being there for one another. The 12th man is probably what made me come to A&M because everyone was so welcoming and everyone did help each other out and being an Aggie means something so special to me and being an Aggie pretty much translates to being a 12th man in today's campus. From the outside looking in, sure, you're going to see the tradition of the 12th man as students standing at football games well, waving our 12th man towels and yelling really, really loud, but it's so much more than that. It's people who are willing to follow with that leadership, the service, the respect, watching other students, you know, take off their hat the, at the MSC, the Memorial Student Center. It's that spirit that encompasses all of us, and for me, the 12th man is that's who we all are here at Texas A&M. I think I realized that I was part of the 12th man was in the middle of the first semester when I was at one game and just being between all those people cheering for Texas A&M that was the point where I really was like now I'm here and that's the 12th man I, I know what it is now. On that bridge that you have to walk under, it says um, there's a spirit that can never be told. And so for some reason when I saw it, it was just something. And then I saw Kyle Field and just that day, that memory, it will stick with me forever because I am forever a 12th man. So put a penny on Sully and wish me some love and yell farmers fight when a boy back up, throw your arms round each other, and sing hullabaloo, cause that's what we do when we bleed.